Big weekend, I guess, uh, for everybody. No? Yeah. I, well, I saw for you, Sam Roberts. Yeah. I'm not. Don't worry, listeners. Please do not be alarmed. <laughs> we are not going to do a wrestling break. It Wouldn't was Sam idea. Roberts. At, no, it would be a bad idea. No. It was Sam Roberts at a wrestling event. But we're not talking about the wrestling event itself. But I do want to talk about the kind of peripheral stuff of why you were there on Father's Day. Oh. Because it was a big weekend. And what I'm saying is because of Father's Day for everybody. Oh. And how did you get such good tickets? Yeah, that's true. Where well, were you? I was right on the aisle. I mean, what was the event? There's No Way Out. WWE's No Way Out pay-per-view. Did yeah. they lock all the doors and chain them? Like, no. literally, No Way Out? <laughs> but there was one cage match, so you could see where that would work in. Oh, okay. I yeah. thought maybe they just caged or, or chained all the doors so the uh, audience the could not And leave. that would seem dangerous, because if there's an emergency, a fire or anything, everyone would uh, surely perish. It's surprisingly very safe for the audience. Oh, okay. Yeah. That's no way out. That's kind of a... All right, so it's the cage thing. Mm -hmm. uh, but now you were sitting very close. You, you tweeted a picture, of course, braggart, <laughs> that you had uh, nice seats. How'd you, how'd you hook those up? Well, one of the uh, guys who does commentary named Josh Matthews hooked it up for me. Oh. So I've been hanging out with him and a little bit. Inside. Oh, you're using him. He knows you're using him, right? I'm not using him. You're hanging out with the guy who does commentary for wrestling, and he doesn't yeah. think you're using him. Oh. We're hanging out. What have you been doing with him? <laughs> we, we were in we were in Hoboken over the weekend. Ugh. Homoken? No, not Homoken. Oh, I thought you were talking about what you toured. Yeah. Are you, you summering know. with him? No. <laughs> we just <laughs> exchange a text every now and then. He's in yeah. town. We're yeah. hanging out. We'll go yeah. to the, he's like, hey, I'll hook you up for the show. He says, I need a blowjob, and you say, well, I want to see the show. <laughs> <laughs> If that were the case, it would have yes. been. Wrestling's answer to Sandusky. It would have <laughs> no? been worth it. Yeah, yeah. Well, it was good seat. You did have very good seats. Fifth row aisle. But you abandoned uh, your dad, who, who just recently performed your nuptials for your uh, grand wedding. Yeah, well. He and, and it's Father's Day, and you weren't even with him. He lives close by, number one. Number two, I just have to do with anything. I could see him today if I wanted. Today's to. not Father's Day. It could That's be. Right. Oh, I'm sure. Uh, when you woke up on Christmas morning, run downstairs to an empty tree. <laughs> yeah. uh, your dad just said, "Ah, we could give him presents tomorrow." Yeah. He no, does. once you miss the day, it's over, Johnny. My dad's not one for celebration anyway, and I got two siblings. So my brother and sister. Siblings. Were... Siblings. Oh, he did say siblings. Did say. <laughs> you fucking eye replace him with an e, motherfucker. <laughs> I right, have right hard siblings. <laughs> Hope you D. <laughs> <laughs> All right, you have your siblings, and yeah. they are they what represented you? They were oh, there. That's wonderful. He had a nice day, and he'll yeah. be able to have a second nice day when I come over and say hello and give him a card and everything. All right, but here's the big thing: mm -hmm. you just got married. You're supposed to do like with the wife, perhaps her father for Father's Day. You didn't even make an appearance the first Father's Day after you're married? Well, how could she hang out with her father when she was coming to No Way Out? Oh, no. Yeah! Oh, no. That's how she felt when she said her vows. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh yeah, man. No. You dragged poor Jess all the way to that <laughs> god-fucking wrestling thing. She went to the show and had a great time. The seats were great. The show, what a spectacle it was. I bet. You know, uh, all the pomp and circumstance and the pageantry. So not only were you taking, uh, uh, her father uh, is thinking, you know, my, my little girl, he's taking her away. <laughs> yeah. You literally took her away from a father on Father's Day. Two weeks later on Father's oh, Day. Man. He just couldn't so, have been happy. Just so everybody gets a clear picture yeah. of what's Two to come. Two weeks later. Oh, really? You're this like, is the I'm, future. I'm in charge, I'm motherfucker. In charge. My wife. We're going to wrestling. My girl now. Mm -hmm. And if Father's Day rolls around and we want to go to wrestling, so be it. We're going to wrestling. I don't care even if we just hang out at home. Right. No, nothing to do. We're no. just not coming over. Maybe we'll watch wrestling DVDs. Oh, man. Oh. I should have. I could have went to that last night. I was at a party with uh, Noam from the Comedy Cellar. had people over. And uh, Keith Robinson was there. Oh, yeah? And he was going oh, he was. to, because uh, he had uh, a friend who knows somebody in it and had an extra ticket. Is and it I everybody there just by, from knowing people? Yeah, I should have <laughs> went. Just go. You should have. Have you ever been to a live show? M well, yes. I saw Sergeant Slaughter wrestle oh. when I was a kid. My dad took me. And I remember I almost spit in his face. Why? Because he, he, he walked by that close to but me. He was, was the patriotic guy. Yeah, was he? A, no, was but he, he was fighting Bob Backlund at the time. <laughs> I, I, I oh. liked Bob Backlund. I didn't oh, go for that. The Iron Sheik was and you're, always his. Uh, nemesis, yeah, Sergeant Slaughter yes. was normally a good guy. No, but he whipped no. Bob Backlund. My God, we're talking about wrestling. I uh -huh. didn't want this to happen. Well, you should go to a show now, though, Jim. Oh, I would go. Um, 
I didn't know CM Punk was wrestling. I'd go to see him because I like him. Of course he's wrestling. He's the WWE champion. No, but I know he wrestled every match. He's the champ. Is he not going to uh, wrestle at a pay-per-view? Oh, I don't know. How if you guys do him every 20 minutes as a pay-per-view? <laughs> yeah. There's one at 11 o'clock this morning. The fucking, uh, on the way to the airport view. <laughs> 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 yeah, it's every well, it's fucking not, week. They don't get like three months between matches to actually train and all that stuff. No. CM Punk will have another match tonight. Oh, whatever. oh he will. Yeah. That wasn't televised? It was on pay-per-view. Oh, it was. Oh, yeah. it was a pay-per-view mm-hmm. event. Oh, okay. Did you get on camera? I think so, yeah. I was getting really? tweets from people oh. that saw my dumb mug. Uh, See, this is when wrestling was and... good. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> no, it's not. It's a very old clip here where they just go back and forth oh, putting Slaughter. each other in a, and that's Bob an arm thing. Oh, is that Backlund? Oh, yeah. Oh, he's wearing the tights, the old-fashioned tights. And, he, and, and, and Charger Slaughter's doing the handshake thing. Yeah. Looks like they're in Japan, though. <laughs> that's great. Uh, so you, you, you went. Oh, yeah. But now I hear tell <laughs> I somebody. You say that. <laughs> I hear, <laughs> hear tell. It's never good for someone after around that. the old gossip mill. Mm-hmm. I hear that um, somebody wanted to go, just like Sam Roberts, the do his own thing, his own man. That's right, Sam Roberts, boss of his household. Sam Roberts, the real man's man, man's man. Someone else wanted to go, but perhaps. Didn't have that certain confidence and power in his own life that Sam has. Someone else even had tickets at will call. Oh, no. Oh, and they tickets. went unused. <laughs> now, <laughs> that's ver- by the way, very bad. It's in very bad form to leave tickets at will oh, call without calling and canceling them. Yeah. That's I don't know ve- if they were canceled in very bad or not, form. but mm. they were at will call. What kind of dumb? You know who else had him at will call? Mm-hmm. Rodney King. He didn't pick him up. Either. <laughs> no, he wouldn't Very have uh, <laughs> classless move. Uh, so, so uh, our own E Rock, yeah, could not go to the event. <laughs> Poor E Rock. Why? why? Now, why couldn't you go? Let's hear E Rock's side, and then let's hear the completely accurate Sam Roberts side. <laughs> e Rock, uh, what's your excuse? Um, I had to go to a family barbecue for Father's Day <laughs> that started after 5 p.m. All right, so Ooh. it's so you had to go see your dad and everything, right? Not my dad. Oh! oh. oh. Who has a barbecue after 5 on a Sunday? I know. That about. After 5? When did it go? to Like 8.30? Uh... Nine. Oh, man. Yeah. Just cut a nice chunk out of your Sunday night. Yeah. You know what? You should have seen Mr. Talk on Friday. He had said that he had already called his father-in-law and said, listen. I'm, I'm the boss of the household, Alice. <laughs> I'm the boss. I'm not going to be able to make it. And his no, father-in-law. I said I was going to leave early. And his father-in-law said, uh, why? And he said, I'm going to a wrestling show. When I got married, I said two things. I do, and I'm the boss. <laughs> and his father-in-law said, seriously? And E-Rock said, yeah. Yeah. I'll wow. be at the wrestling show. Did he really say show. seriously? And then he said, why don't you fuck off? Yeah. <laughs> oh, maybe he didn't say that. <laughs> so wait, you, you, uh, you, you were pressured into going to this god-awful 5 p.m. barbecue? It wasn't <laughs> awful. It stunk. Oh, it was, it, stink. <laughs> was it better than the pay-per-view? Well, once 8 o'clock hit, no. <laughs> no, I didn't think so. Oh. 7.30 was pre-show, by the way. What so, else is going on in that yard, aside from the barbecue? That yeah, was fun. Certainly no volleyball or anything, because it's dark. <laughs> what's, what's going on besides mosquitoes biting everybody? You had no candles? Eating, drinking, they were playing football. Fucking, sucking. Yeah. They were playing uh, what? Family playing football, football game in the Wait, backyard. Oh, really? the, the, the Kennedys? Kennedy? Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Yuck. Uh, throw me a pass. <laughs> Do you think it's like Meet the Parents, except they all hate E-Rock instead oh, of them all hating Ben Stiller? Uh, can you go around? I'll hand it off to you, E-Rock. Yeah. Oh, he fumbles it. No, they all the... hand it off to him and then pile on like a fucking in the longest yard. <laughs> <laughs> he fucking he fumbles it every time because he's got greasy barbecue yeah. chicken fingers. <laughs> <laughs> Who got mayo on the football? Oh, we got to wash the football again, E-Rock. Uh, so, wow, well, you didn't go to the wrestling thing. You no, had to, had to go in the, go. the backyard barbecue. Yeah. Football in the backyard, a big yard. Uh, yeah, they have a. Uh, really... Are they are they as wealthy as the Nagels? Um, this is if... one of those arranged marriages, like a fucking <laughs> yeah. King of Thrones, <laughs> if not more so. Yeah, Whoa. Game of Thrones, Game of Thrones, King of Thrones. <laughs> what am I saying? I say, King say of Rodney Thrones King on the brain. <laughs> <laughs> That'd be the King of Drains. <laughs> oh, Rodney. <laughs> uh, wow. Yeah, yeah they nice. do all right. They do all right. You got a pool. Uh, not at that house, no. They Where do they live? At that, at that house. house. Hey. Whoa. Excuse me. Jeez, the Nagel. Where do they have a pool? 
the, 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 the her other family has pools. At, at this particular other house, family. they didn't have a pool. Uh, other family. Mm-hmm. What's Excuse going me. on there? The Nagel house. You know Where does they, she live? Jersey? Yeah. You know what mm-hmm. they didn't have? A wrestling ring with a steel cage around oh, it. Oh, shit. Did you want to go to the wrestling match? No escape from the barbecue. Yeah, I no wanted, I did want to go. <laughs> no escape, whatever and the then fuck it's called. I got uh, talked to because I was streaming the pay-per-view on my phone instead of interacting with the family. <laughs> when did you find out you weren't going to get to go to the show? Um, about 4.30. That you, late? Yeah. Whose edict was oh, it? Oh, man. So I, I, I sent a message saying I, I can't use the tickets. Oh, you did? Give them to somebody Wait, else. Wait, how, how did oh, it come at 4.30? Minute. What happened? I thought I was going to be able to still leave after a couple hours and head over to, <laughs> to the arena, and that wasn't so. How, what wasn't so? What happened? <laughs> there, there was a... Uh, there was a loud discussion as far as uh, this was going what? to happen. Oh, uh, was there a little uh, little tiff at the Nagel residence yeah, about ca- this? It caused a few uh, problems. Did, what, they, did you get yelled at? Um, sure, if you want to call it that. You were told you were going to the barbecue and you were not going to some oh, stupid fucking on. wrestling thing. Yeah. Wow. Uh, oh, no. <laughs> wow. You're like 31 years old. Oh, and did you see Sam Roberts when you were streaming it on your phone? I saw. Having all fun with his wife and stuff. <laughs> I saw. Jess had a blast. Oh, Jess was having fun. Why didn't you go with your wife? <laughs> she, she refused to go to those things. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> Trouble in paradise. I've asked, but she just will never go to those things. Wow. Why? She she hates it. Wow. That's and Eric so is the putting rift. on the... New Jersey Devils jerseys to show support for her. Right, because yeah, she was, was never really a into... hockey fan before no. her. You guys got to compromise. Mm. Yeah. That's her way of getting back at you. She's so <laughs> sick of him lollygagging around the house and just lumping it up in the oh, living room. With his dumb action figures and everything. <laughs> yeah, and his stupid sneakers, oh. eating fucking lime chips, whatever. <laughs> What's that? She's had enough. <laughs> so, wow. Who told you, you you can't go? Like, <laughs> Who gave you the order? Uh... Well, when when you're told, fine, go ahead, you're allowed to go. Oh, that I sounds knew. good. When I, a wife yeah, says I, that, uh, it means you can go, right? Yeah. <laughs> uh, but when your car is blocked in on the driveway and she refuses to move her car. Oh, my God. And then God. starts yelling. So what is she yelling anyway? at you in front of her family? No, this was still at home. Uh, this is before we even left for the barbecue. What did she say? She 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 wasn't happy. I, I don't really want to go into it. She just was not having any of this. No, well, what did she say to yeah, you? It's not, it's not private. Don't talk about the whole marriage. Talk about just. Yeah. <laughs> it's not a private situation. <laughs> well, when, when it gets turned into, why do you hate me? Oh, and then I'm like, oh, oh damn. Right. Why does she think you hate her? Did you step on her foot? <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> See, wives got to understand something like that, though. It's not yeah. you don't hate them. You just want to do something. Aside from what she wants to do, yeah. yeah, you just love wrestling more, right? Yeah, <laughs> yeah, that's what I was accused of. You love scantily, <laughs> scantily clad, muscular men more than your own wife, and that's fine. And then at, at the barbecue, while I'm watching the pay per view, and then mm. she found out I, I had the pay per view on my phone. Oh boy! She started screaming, "Can't you get off your fucking phone for five minutes?" And, oh no! Yeah, oh, wow. was she drunk? No, she oh, was not. Shit. She was not. She was. How long have you been married? Uh, just over a year and a half. Oh, great. Oh, oh my God. Cool. Only 50 years to go. <laughs> but you don't think E-Rock compromises a lot and does her stuff, though? <laughs> yes, of course he does her stuff. He did her stuff oh, yesterday. Did. What was yesterday? The barbecue. The barbecue. It was oh, her I mean, family. But I mean, is that why she's annoyed that you never compromise? Uh, no, she thinks I, I get antisocial a lot, so... That's her biggest problem. Well, then why does she drag uh, you to places you don't want to be? See, I, I wanted to say that, and I didn't, but... I mean, you do get antisocial. I don't... I, I didn't have a problem being at her family. I, I love her family and everything. Yeah, but you I didn't just, like going to some dumb barbecue at yeah. 5 o'clock to go to that pay-per-view. Yeah, you that's like the McMahons stupid. more than her family. Yeah. That's fine. Yeah, that's Father's fair. Day. Imagine Father's Day at the McMahons. I like the McMahons more than my family. Uh, they understand. Oh, you're Did your terrible. wife have fun? Yeah, she had a lot of fun. That's, that's the way you do it. Did you see the families in the afternoon? Uh, no, we call my dad, and uh, oh, good, we'll see them during the week, though. We oh, saw them last week. You know, we see her, We live close to the family, so we see them like, every couple weeks. How often does she see her family? Not at all? Um, more often than I see my family, but not, oh. not that often. 
and she starts screaming at you to get off your fucking phone. Yeah. Wow. And, you, and, you, and you did, didn't you, Buster? Oh, man, did no, he the, hit that off button quick? Yeah, Buster did. got right off his oh, phone. Oh, yeah. No, the pay-per-view stayed on for a while longer, but well, she you're was a rebel. talking to me. You so. are, uh, I think you rocks a bit what they call pussy whipped. I think so, yeah. too. Oh, pussy whipped. Right? You're a little henpecked. He loves that on his ice cream. Pussy whip. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he doesn't like ice cream. Forgot about that. Cake. Your sweet sandwiches. Yeah. Sandwiches. Uh, yeah, wow. That's a little pussy whip, though. Yeah. You should be like, hey, I'm going. This is a one-time event, one -time event this week. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> yeah. No way out comes but once a year. <laughs> yes. Oh, I would hate that. Oh, you rock. That's a sad at, story. At what time did you leave the barbecue? 9.30. Oh, it's too late for a bar. No I kept one. I saying, I was like, we really need to to leave, oh. and we were the last ones to leave. Oh, well, that you was just her punishing him. Yeah, I'm was. mad that she you... was punishing him. Yeah. Dude, I've been in that situation where all I want to do is leave, and I'm walking around, and she's still fucking jabber John. Yip 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 yip, and I'm just like, fuck, let's go. I want to leave like without saying goodbye or anything. Just jump in the fucking car and go. Well, I'll say goodbye, but it's just like around nine thirty. I should be watching TV in bed already or, or trying to go to sleep. Not hey, oh, I so got a forty minute drive home. And... Wait, <laughs> e Rock, if you were at the pay per view, you would have left early to go home and go to bed by nine thirty. No, that I that, <laughs> that I would have left early. <laughs> yeah, That's that was done at eleven. Special event, <laughs> eleven, huh? Yeah. Did you watch it at home or w was that? I missed every. Well, I got what I saw on my phone at that point. Uh... But I, the middle to the end of it, I lost, which is the really is great. Now, part why, of it. when you got home, could you not have watched it? Because I didn't order it through my cable. But why didn't you watch the rest on your phone? You just punished. I was driving. So why didn't you put it on? Listen it would to take it. an hour and a half to get home. It took like forty minutes. Could to get she home. drive? Why didn't you listen to the uh, watch the end of it on your phone? You knew she would fucking unload on yeah, you if scared. you were even home watching it on. The <laughs> she had uh. beat you down so badly by that point you couldn't even watch it in your own house. But can't you just be, like, nice at her things and not be on your phone, and then she will be nice for your things? Um, well, she puts up with a lot. Like what? A lot of my nonsense, so. She didn't let you go to the pay-per-view. You had tickets. When it comes to family stuff, I really can't. Oh, you had tickets. Man. She's probably, her that. thinking is this one thing. Yeah. Have you seen her, and have you seen him? <laughs> <laughs> she probably said that to him finally. Have you looked at me and then looked at you? How about you do one thing for me? One thing. The pay-per-view. That's all I'm asking. You don't Just think he should have compromised? Absolutely not. He should have been at the pay-per-view. He you, had yeah. tickets. Do you think that this is the beginning of a fucking downward spiral? Oh, absolutely. Into not doing what he wants? Forget about it. Oh, I'm sorry. This is the third act of a downward spiral. Yeah. This yeah. is definitely not the beginning. You're going you're gonna to start building up resentments. Eventually. And resentment in marriage is the death knell, man. That is fucking bad. Eventually, she'll be like, no, Monday night is dance night. You can't I, watch yeah. Raw. <laughs> you uh, yeah. can't. I resented uh, my wife for uh, not allowing me to have sex with other women <laughs> unless she was in the room. The resentment just chipped away and really ruined the marriage. That? Yeah. <laughs> well, she has probably resentment against him, though. He doesn't yeah. resent her. She's probably just tired of him sitting around eating fucking, like, meat ice cream floats or whatever it is he enjoys <laughs> yeah. on a fucking Friday night just doing yeah. childish things. Yeah. Steak martinis. What was the last thing? Coke floats. floats. Coke floats. What was yeah. the last thing she made you do that you really didn't want to do? <laughs> Barbecue. Yeah, go to the, go to the <laughs> gym. That. <laughs> <laughs> That's true. She did get in the, the personal trainer. Close oh. the fridge. <laughs> uh, <laughs> Sorry. <right? laughs> uh, an event, a family thing, something where you were just like, I don't want to be here, but I'm here well, because he pretend she said gardening. gardening. Whoa! Hold the phone. You're gardening? We're redoing the whole back and side of the property. And what does that entail? Um, oh, man. Uh, pulling out what was already there, tilling all the earth, replanting. You're mulch. tilling the earth? <laughs> tilling earth. <laughs> like Paw Ingalls. <laughs> uh, oh, oh, shit. We got these tools we put it in like a corkscrew to rip up the ground so it, it turns Why do it you do it? Hire and... someone to do that. Well, she, she the does that. Fuck? The Nagels but... have uh, some money. What are you doing? <laughs> Yeah, I mow the lawn too, and that gardening. Yeah, gardening. Uh, and what are you pulling weeds and shit? Well, yeah, I started that, and then I said, "Fuck that!" I hired somebody to, that comes in and sprays and oh, pulls all the weeds man. out. Because I started ripping plants out, not knowing what was a weed and what was <laughs> it a plant. Just looks like a weed. Anything green was just getting yanked out of there. Would you laugh if he disturbed a hornet nest? <laughs> <and got laughs> stung? Oh, great, and he got even more bloated because <laughs> of all oh, the stings. Oh. <laughs> It's unnecessary. Something about that seat, huh?
She uh, she <laughs> made you do this. She made you do this. Um, and you didn't want to. Well, it had to be done before we could do other things, like what? in the backyard. So mm. oh. other designs and oh. what were we doing? Oh, Just masonry plans. work and fencing and big you, plans for the South Forty. Yeah, yeah. You should, because she's a big New Jersey Devils fan. Huge. Next really? season. Yeah, oh yeah. You should be like no. You can't go to the Devils games because you've been ignoring me, and I want a dinner at home with you. Ah, what do you think would happen there, Iraq? She'd laugh. Oh, oh Jesus. My God. She'd call her friend and said, all right, I got tickets. I'm going. Uh-oh, guy friend? No, no, no. Oh. Then how can you possibly let her tell you you can't go to a wrestling show? Because it's not interfering with a family event. That's Then the schedule a family event yes. on a Devils game. Exactly. Oh, yeah, yeah. you got to get her back for this or else you're, you, you're not a man. You know how quick I would schedule family events every Devils game, every All home game. Yep, every one. Not a bad idea. Mm. Yeah, he won't, he won't. and she would still, oh, she, she would ditch him to go. go to the Devils game. He'd be at some family event. He doesn't want to be at either. Should have went. You should have gone. So me and you could have talked about it today. God <laughs> damn it! Great. Both of you on pay per view, just big shit eating grins on your <laughs> yeah, face. Yeah, laughing. I didn't know oh, you had those extra yeah. tickets there. Great. Right. Well, they were just sitting at Wilco. You could have told him you were Eric Nagel. Nah, you mm. need ID. Mm. Man, I don't know who to call for wrestling tickets. I can get you wrestling. Oh, tickets. he'll get you. He can get anybody, even E-Rock. E right. They'll always have leftovers from the ones yeah. E-Rock's not Just using. Just step up so. to the window and say, uh, Eric Nagel, and they'll be like, oh, yeah, here they are. Yeah. Here's two. Front and center. Are they front row tickets he passed up? No, 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 no. I don't think his tickets They're sort of like nee, nee, nee. what you get at UFC. They're the one level above, so you're even I with get the, the ring. floor now. I've oh, only had that a couple talking times. those tickets. I'm like, <laughs> yeah, they're really good. And uh, I was at a barbecue. Gas or coals? That would be gas. Uh, not even coals. <laughs> no. Damn it. Would you eat the barbecue? It tastes better. Everything. <laughs> yeah. He ate his sorrows away. <laughs> All his frustrations. Oh, yeah. And his Were you just every chewing your frustrations? <laughs> everything he wanted to say to his wife, he said to his steak. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck, I wanted to go to that. I'm going to eat like the big show then. <laughs> Where were you hiding to watch it on your phone? <laughs> I was I was out in the open. I was sitting outside in in the back, oh. um, where all the tables and chairs were. I was just sitting there with the phone right on the table. And how long before she came up? How how much did you get to see before she came up and said, "What the fuck are you doing?" Um, the first time I was watching for about ten minutes. Oh boy! Oh wow! And, and but she scolded you again. Scolded you. After that, she she was she was walking around talking to the family, and everything, and then she was like, "Where's Eric?" Oh, I looked no. outside. I'm still out there watching on my phone. And uh, then she came out again. She feels like his mom. Oh, oh God. She yeah. does. You know what I mean? Like, I shouldn't have to tell him this. Yeah. Like, uh, she's more pissed that she has to tell you than that you're doing it. That pisses women off even more. Yeah. You think she's embarrassed by her husband? Yeah. That he's just sitting yes. out there? In she's embarrassed? Her, I, I swear she is, yeah. And it's her family, and they're like... This is the Do guy. <laughs> like this uh, is the guy. He's not watching wrestling on TV. <laughs> no, not even on TV. On his cell on his phone. Telephone. Oh wow! He's streaming wrestling pay per views on his phone. Oh. How much did it cost you on the phone? It didn't. He did it illegally. <laughs> oh, he is a rebel. Why can't what? you support WWE a little Why'd bit? Why'd you steal it? If I was at home, I would have paid for it. No, you wouldn't. Have. No, my phone, you, she wouldn't like, have allowed that either. She wouldn't have. Oh man, you're not putting that shit on my TV. <laughs> watch it on your computer. Do you watch a lot of wrestling at home? Oh, when he's allowed. Twice a week, three times with pay per view. Oh my god, and she doesn't like it. So what does she do when you're watching she these? She watches other shit. Where in another room? In another room. So you two are in separate rooms. You're watching wrestling. She's watching something else, and you do this three times a week. Monday night, Friday night, and then Friday, Friday night. Friday night is spent watching wrestling while your wife's in another room. Well, usually it's DVR, so I'll watch it at some point. But... So, so I just and do you ever like after a great match, you just want to talk about it with somebody? Oh man. And you go in the room and she just doesn't want to hear it. She has no fucking has no excitement interest in or interest. And you're just uh. like, oh, you know what just happened? I know you're not into this, but let me tell yeah. you. And, and, and you're just trying to bounce it off of somebody. And Phil the Masher uh, <laughs> pinned <laughs> Billy Lips. Oh, no. What happened? <laughs> Lost his hat. <laughs> yeah. Oh, it was great. You know, oh, as much man. as she doesn't like wrestling, Jess knows Every character, oh, every finishing move. Does every she not love line. wrestling? She doesn't like wrestling. She doesn't like wrestling, but she loves Sam Roberts. That's right. That's the difference. And we compromise for each other. How do you compromise yeah. for her? Well, any, all, like if there are family events for her, I will not 
be on my phone the whole time. I'll oh. be active with oh. her family. Oh, no matter what's on, maybe even wrestling. You wouldn't. Wrestling wouldn't be on because That's I'd be like, we're going, be... To, we're going to the pay-per-view, babe. You, you got that right. Okay. All you right. Know, or, or if she wanted to, we let her choose the movie. If she mm. wants to go see a chick flick or something, I'm all for it. And I okay. Don't pout about it. I don't pout when we do her things. And so she, she does my things. E-Rock, what happens... If, uh, let's say, Friday night rolls around, mm -hmm. you come home, you're all set for some wrestling, and candles are lit around the house. <laughs> uh, you walk in, and uh, she's in some, uh, you know, a nighty type thing, and candles are lit, and uh, she wants to have a romantic Friday night. I grab a beer and sit down and play EverQuest. Oh, <laughs> yeah, well, that's exactly what I did. Uh, boy, they don't like that at all. No? When, uh, it's, uh... Would you pretend you didn't notice night. the candles being lit? Yes, I did. Ah, it's I'd the just worst. Be like, ah. I'd say, I, I'd talk about, like, how, how my day was just like, oh, God, oh, oh, like, try to diffuse the whole thing. It's so hard as a man when you want to avoid fucking, because chicks don't know how to... We're so used to their signals when they want to avoid right. giving up some puss, mm -hmm. but they don't know how to handle when a guy doesn't want to fuck them. Yeah, and if that's the case, boy, there's a problem in the relationship. So wait, you, you would pretend you didn't see the candles and just yeah. talk about your day? Yeah, I would walk in and be like, oh, God, like if I was angry or frustrated about my day, that, you know, how, how am I supposed to, you know, be all romantic? And I'd just make myself a Captain of Coke really quickly, very strong. <laughs> And uh, drink myself into the ability to fuck her. <laughs> oh, it no. It was always horrible. It is the worst when I you know they want wanna, dick. Oh, I did not want to be with her. Ugh. I don't think this is all Erock's wife's fault, though. I, I think of course it's not. Because Erock doesn't compromise and do things for her, and he buys, like, Millennium Falcon Legos instead oh, of like, hanging Falcon out Legos. with her. You know what? She does put up with that. Then she's like, well... She bought it for me. Oh. She, she's hoping yeah. you'd swallow a piece. <laughs> <laughs> How far along are you with that, by the way? Oh, yeah. Uh, it's uh, The pieces are laid out. I haven't started it yet. Oh, oh well. no. What the fuck? Why'd they're you off, hang out with her? They're on a table in the basement right now. Why? I so had... you got to go down into the basement when you're doing this? That's probably keeping you from doing it. Yeah. No real Is windows there a TV and down sunlight. There? Yeah, there's a TV down there. Oh, man. Yeah, oh. the steps. <laughs> trying to have an elevator put in. <laughs> Go to the basement. He's got one of those wheelchairs on the sides. Like, <laughs> yeah, what's like, your name in the Sopranos? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mother. <laughs> oh, E Rock. So when do you when are you gonna have time to do that between uh, wrestling and and paying any attention to your wife? <laughs> Hopefully soon. Yeah. Yeah. Whew. Do you guys uh, have a, you know do you guys have a lot of sex? Oh, you have to go in like how many times yeah. a week? But is it, is it, we is do all right every yeah. week. Yeah, every week. It's not as much as when you first. Got together. That never happens, right? Yeah, but no, that was you know, that was over six years ago. Oh wow! You get along better when you're fucking, man. You really do. Yeah, you really do. It's weird. Like once I know you can't keep that forever. It's very difficult once it drops off. Like you fuck, you know. It's like you're not gonna fuck when you're a year into the relationship, like you did the first week. But yeah, yeah, you got to average it out though somewhere. Yeah. Once you stop having yeah. a sex, uh, and and then you start thinking like, wow, when was the last time? Oh boy. It is over. Time to bail. That's a big part of it. And it's not just the sex thing. That's kind of an indicator of other shit. Right. It's not just, oh, we're, we're just not having sex, but everything else is hunky-dory. We have to physically like seeing each other. There you go. You know what I mean? Not only That's you, it. Just like not be, because if you're not having sex, you're probably disgusted by each other. Yeah, you just don't want to fucking see each other or hang around with each other or be alone with each other. There's always got to be some kind of distraction. And that's death. Oh, that is the worst. Yeah. Oh, there have been times I would, you know, jump into bed, and the first thing I would do is grab that remote, try to find something on. <laughs> or you immediately go and lay on your side. Oh, so it's like lay on the side, grab the remote, put a movie on I've seen 80 times. <laughs> it's not even like it's something new and cool. Yeah. Shh, this is a good part. Or give her a kiss that she can't interpret as sexual. Like, I used to do that, too, Nana. if I didn't want to fuck. Yeah, like a little pick on a kiss on the fucking, uh, the, ch the upper chub of the fucking cheek. <laughs> <laughs> and make it noise. Mwah. <laughs> Mwah. <laughs> Love you. Oh. <laughs> and then lay down on the other side. You lay down, lay down, the down the side. Oh, my back. <laughs> Maybe take your arm and fling it over behind you just so it's laying on the quilt <laughs> on her leg or something, maybe. And that moves within two seconds. I am exhausted. Yeah. yeah. Oh, boy. Uh, yeah, well, we haven't had any sex lately or anything. Yeah, it's, just, it's tired. You're it's tired, timing. right? I'm tired. Uh, yeah, tired, yeah. Right? Yeah, that happens, uh, you know, in a new relationship.
Oh, yeah, just tired. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Just tired. That's why we didn't fuck eight times. 